All right, um, so first things first, I decided to venture into a different type of clothing and make a vest. Um, I got this pattern from YouTube and I will link it in the description. This is Hey Hey Crochet's 70s vest pattern. Um, I did make it with Red Heart yarn. Um, this is an ombre yarn, it's called Sea Coral. See the other side. Um, and it just came out fantastically, if you ask me. Now this is slightly altered from her pattern um, in terms of how many rows and stitches I put on the sides and the tops. I mean, yeah, on the sides and the tops, just simply because I want it to be a larger size and I want it to fit men. Um, so this is probably like an extra large. Um, a few things you won't see here are some commissions that have already been sent out to their owners. Uh, so I will throw in some photos. I did make another one of these vests for a client, but I did it in blue. Uh, so that one's already gone um, to LA. Um, to match this hat, of course, I made a bucket hat to accompany, accompany it. Um, so these are all, everything that you'll see here is up on my Depop. Um, but this I love. I haven't worn it yet myself, um, but I think I'm going to pair it with like a white dress, something simple and wear it. Maybe something with like some length to it. Um, but I definitely want to showcase these colors because I think it's beautiful. Um, I did make a couple of hats, of course. You guys know I love mixing acrylic and cotton together in my hats. Here's one, here's another one. Now this one is actually, this one is actually, okay. So this one is actually a copy of a design of a pair of earrings that I made. Um, I did make a couple of earrings this month, acrylic. This is one of them. So as you can tell, they match. Um, I haven't put a flower on it, but I have one. I just need to do it. I did make a couple of pairs of earrings with acrylic charms. Um, I made the rookie mistake of not getting it two-sided and as an earring, of course, you know, it's gonna like move around. So I'm not completely satisfied with these. Um, so I don't really want to sell them yet. Um, I am talking to other merchandisers who can print front and back acrylic charms for me. Um, so more earrings are to come, needless to say, um, I've really, definitely fallen in love with jewelry making more than I thought I would. Um, so jewelry is to come. Feel free to check out lulaoarts.com uh, for stickers, buttons, all that other kind of stuff. Um, this hat I absolutely love. As you guys know, I do not sew in ends until I sell it. <laughs> but this is a fuzzy hat, excuse my hair. And this is the gopher fur. Oh, I love it. It makes me feel like I should go skiing. <laughs> um, I just kind of figured it out. Uh, I had a couple people tell me that I need to feel for the stitches. Um, so needless to say, I figured it out um, and I love it. I definitely want to make another one. Um, I made this hexagonal cardigan. Now this is Premier Yarns. Uh, they're chunky yarn. I'll link it in the description, um, but it's in the colorway Tulip, and I love this. It falls just about three quarters here, um, and it's just beautiful. I mean, you could really pair it with almost anything, and it goes great. Um, I also had the pleasure of creating a penny top um, for a client, and if you guys don't remember, I'll throw a picture in um, of both of them, but the penny top, I made it in Aaron Fleck by Red Heart Yarn, and that one has gone to its owner as well. So you guys just get left with the picture, <laughs> so you'll see that. Um, and I got heavy into screen printing. So this says Crochet and Hydrate. Um, I got a screen made on Etsy, um, and I've just been printing away, needless to say. I take this, this particular bag I take with me to the pool whenever I go. And of course, some shirts. I also made it in white. All of these things, of course, can be found at luloarts.com. Um, this 
screen printing has made me want to get into streetwear. So now my mind is going a hundred different directions about what other kind of things I can put on t-shirts and bags and that kind of thing. Um, but this month definitely picked up on commissions. I'm actually currently working on another vest as we speak um, and two hats. So I'm waiting for some yarns to come in um, and I'm excited to have, you know, custom pieces to make for people. Uh, my commissions are open, so if you're interested, feel free to hit me up. Um, of course, IG, Lula O Arts, feel free to DM me. Um, all the links will be in the description. Uh, I also have some 10% off, 15% off, one month free, uh, $10 off sticker mule links down in that description as well. So if you want some free money or a discount or a month free of Epidemic Sound, uh, feel free to click those links in the description. Thank you for watching.